Zelda. But I like uh, very much that the same treatment will be applied to the seizure vessel. I think that's very important because this number reflects the gravity of the, the situation in Syria during the last 11 years. I think that uh, it will play an important role in calling attention of uh, the international community for the situation in Syria that is dreadful. And, and something that uh, the report reveals very clearly is the absence of the protection of civilians and no faction, uh, no party in the conflict in Syria care about uh, the protection of uh, the lives of the civilians. That is <laughs>investigation on Syria, we have cooperated with several uh, judicial systems uh, in different countries. Uh, we have in the last four years 60 important cases uh, that counted on our uh, data, our information. Then for the time being, I don't see any uh, possibility in the horizon mm -hmm. for, the, for the referral to the Inter International Criminal Court. That is positive that so many European countries are doing, mm -hmm. are prosecuting, and, and in some cases condemning yes. uh, 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 people uh, uh, that committed um, uh, crimes Germany, against yeah. humanity or what kind. <laughs> the urban environment is completely devastated. And now because of uh, uh, several uh, economic crisis in Lebanon, the present uh, crisis in Ukraine, mm -hmm. uh, the economic situation in Syria is, is, okay. uh, is very uh, uh, difficult. And 90% of the population uh, live under the line of poverty. Then it's, uh, it's a, it's a very, uh, very uh, uh, difficult situation. That is very important uh, to conclude to say that is vital uh, to have uh, international humanitarian aid. And uh, the problem is that uh, in the next weeks, the Security Council will decide, that I think this is pathetic, will decide to maintain or to cut, mm -hmm. to eliminate the only access for cross-border uh, humanitarian aid uh, uh, to Syria. I think uh, for me, involved with the Syrian crisis for a le uh, 11 years, it's very depressing uh, to see this difference of treatment. Mm. That is, uh, there is open arms and generosity vis-a-vis -vis the Ukrainians. That I, um, I, I, I don't criticize this at all. They deserve that. But I'd like uh, very much that the same treatment will be applied to the Syrian refugees. And I have the opportunity to express this in, in many bilateral conversations uh, with uh, uh, European uh, countries that are very supportive of our work.